All right, guys, welcome to the first uh, little online session of content we're creating to push out in the market so you can learn what we're doing to help uh, mortgage lenders, real estate agents, and other professionals build rock solid brands, real brands, big company brands uh, at, um, you know, at the highest level. And, and that's kind of one of the biggest different difference makers in uh, working with us is we're not only in the real estate and mortgage space, so we're in the trenches building our businesses up like you are, uh, but we're not just generating buyers and sellers for you. We're helping you build a really big brand, the right brand. And one of the ways we do that is programmatic marketing. Uh, this session we recorded live uh, yesterday, but there were some some technical difficulties and the you know some some delays and uh, some of the the uh, the recording. So here's a little intro. Clay Clay Vaughn is is our our head of that division when it comes to programmatic marketing. They have been able to be very successful in securing the contracts needed to, to do this type of marketing. This is the type of marketing that big companies do, um, you know, major corporations. And we take that same strategy to you and help you build an unbelievable brand like the big guys. Clay's about to lay it out for you. And you can see kind of a, a brief breakdown of programmatic marketing um, and where you know, we know through people's IP addresses, if they're searching for homes or if they're searching for loans and we put, uh, you know, we put your, your first class brand and message in front of them because you know that they're looking for what you offer. So very intelligent way to market and very strong way to build a brand. And that's how you scale a business. It's not about buying leads from Zillow or Realtor.com or any other lead source. It's about building your brand to create your own lead sources that are coming in and and build that recognition so the cost to acquire a new customer just continues to go down. So check out this short video, it's some great stuff. And um, uh, if you're interested in talking to us more about this for you, schedule a call with us where we get on a highly productive online meeting and talk about how this is applicable and how we can do things to help you grow your brand and grow your business. Thanks, Jaden. I appreciate the introduction. Yeah, so here at Reverent is the name of the company that, uh, I manage and what we do is we help our clients clarify their message, reach more people and ultimately boost their revenue. And that's what we're excited to talk to you about today. As we talk about Wazango marketing and all of the elements of programmatic marketing that can go with it and how you can take advantage of that. So as we dive in, I'd love just to share a screen and show you uh, a little bit about what programmatic marketing is. So at Wazango, we want to help you guys grow and get more leads and ultimately boost your revenue. So how do we do that? We have to get in front of the right people. So this is how we get in front of the right people. So first things first, programmatic marketing is a, as Jaden said, it's a high level form of marketing. In other words, it allows you to go into a level of detail for your ideal demographic, your audience, more than Facebook, more than any other platform right now. And, uh, and my company and, and uh, Wazango have partnered up so that you guys have access to this. Uh, this is normally only what the big brands have access to, the Coca-Colas, the Hertz uh, car rentals. Uh, but now you guys have access to it. And so you'll see some ads here. This was a screenshot. Um, Outdoor Life is a, is a magazine that I typically read and, and I go to their website on a regular basis. And I was tuning in from a Starbucks. I haven't been looking for a rental car anytime recently, but when you look at where these ads are pulling from and same with Mattress Firm, the video ad on the right hand side, uh, these are all considered programmatic ads. It's targeting based off of the search history connected to the IP address. The IP address is the unique location ID. It's like your home address uh, for your internet location. So what Hertz is doing is they're running programmatic ads that are therefore uh, targeting me at this Starbucks because somebody nearby um, who was searching on that IP address and therefore was getting retargeted to. So uh, this is one example. And then this is real quick what Wazango would be able to do. So we're running programmatic for Wazango and now we're going to see these ads popping up everywhere. And it's not just based off of the publisher site. It's not just because I'm at Outdoor Life. Anywhere I go 
that has these ad tags embedded on the website will automatically pull in the relevant ads to me. So if I'm searching for a mortgage, well, and, and I'm in the target zip code, I'm in the target demographic, and I'm searching for my phone or my, or my home IP address, then I'm going to get targeted with these Wazango ads because, and we'll talk about it in a little bit about how precise we can get. This is another example. At my office, uh, we, we work on the Adobe Cloud. And so randomly on brides.com, uh, we, we see an ad for Adobe. That's not relevant to brides. No bride is interested in enrolling in an Adobe suite platform. Uh, however, Adobe knows that I'm coming from our work address and that we've been searching for Adobe recently. So therefore, they're going to be targeting us with that. Um, here, real quick, a video. So I took a screen recording, a uh, random Paw Patrol video. I've got a three-year-old. And all of a sudden, I realize my wife, she's been searching um, or talking about dog food. We need to go get dog food. Well, all of a sudden, I'm seeing a video ad for dog food from Amazon. This is all programmatic. It's pulling the information that, that uh, Alexa in our home is gathering from our phones or through Facebook and now targeting us with ads. The same thing rings true for you. You have access to be able to target people based off of their search history, based off of their IP addresses search history. So the next step is let's talk a little bit about how it's done. And, and I don't want to get too into the weeds, but I want you to see how precise we can get. So I took a, a screen uh, grab of a test that we're running for uh, an electricity company in Pennsylvania. And we have a lot of data on who we're trying to target. So we, we wanted to run a $1,500 test and out out of that uh, data that we entered in, we found that we could target 537,000 people. 537,000 people for $1,500. You can't get those numbers on Facebook. It's not possible. So we, we were able to target based off of zip codes. So we got all of the zip codes that were relevant to our clients. Uh, clients. And then uh, we entered it into the system as we built out the campaign. We're able to target based off of income level. We're able to target based off of household income level. That is going to be a, an amazing tool for you guys because through Facebook, through Google, you can't do that because they're classified in a different category of advertising and data scraping. We have access through Oracle, through a lot of different platforms right now to pull that data and then make that uh, accessible to our campaigns that we're running for you guys. Lastly, I mean, we can get into the education levels. Uh, all of this is just a, a, a tip of the iceberg of how uh, detailed we can get in targeting these ads uh, with the message and the video message to your audience, wherever they are on the internet. You're no longer bound by social media. You're no longer bound by Facebook's restrictions and their audience network. So we can get down to the level of detail of which ad we want in, in each individual state or even down to what we refer to as geofencing. We can target a specific home address. If we know that there's somebody on our list living at a certain address, we can target that address with our ads uh, so that they know about our brand. And so that's where it's gonna just literally change the landscape uh, for you guys. And I'm really excited to be able to do that for you. Hey, what's interesting as you're done with that, uh... You know, when you're doing it, when we're doing this for mortgage and real estate uh, and putting our message and brand in front of people who are actually looking for a mortgage or looking for a home, um, very intelligent way to market, especially if you have the right message and the right uh, the place to send them to with the high conversion. And we help you with all that. But there's also things that we have to navigate with fair lending, with equal housing opportunity. Uh, and we understand those those rules and those guidelines to make sure that, that we're all in compliance. Um, the name of the game is really understanding what it takes to build a high level top brand. And we're about to roll this out for our mortgage company and we're gearing up for massive scale. We're helping other mortgage company and companies and top, top real estate uh, teams and agencies and brokerages across the country uh, market like this. We have a lot of success on, on running social ads and running Facebook ads, but they limit the ability to target your audience when you're running ads for housing or for lending. And uh, so 
although we continue to do that and have a lot of success, we'll help you do the same thing. This is for, the, 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 for you if you're ready to go to the next level and become a top and premier brand. So if that's just scratching the iceberg of, of what we can do to help you market and, and to grow, but there's a lot more to it, right, Clay? Absolutely. There's so much more to it. And there's a, a whole lot of different ways that we can overcome obstacles that you might be facing in regards to reaching the right audience. And I'm excited to work with you on that. Uh, if you're interested in learning to talk about how this is relevant to you and how it's relevant to your current setup and brand, schedule a call with us, reach out to us, and let's talk about not only programmatic marketing, but how we can build the right message and brand. Uh, because you can't just jump right into programmatic marketing. There's steps that you must complete before you hit that level. Uh, and we can help you kind of navigate that and walk through that process. So uh, Clay, thanks, man, for taking the time to do a little quick message on this. And uh, there'll be a lot more to come. There'll be webinars to come, a lot more in-depth conversation and case studies that we'll be rolling out. Uh, just wanted to give you a taste of how we can help you build the right brand with the right message that puts it in front of the right people at the right time. You know they're searching for houses or a mortgage, and that's the time you, they, you want them to see your ad. So um, reach out, talk to us. Thanks again, Clay, and uh, more good stuff coming soon.